Alright, today I'm going to show you how to multiply a double digit number by a single digit number. So let's pull up, uh, I'm going to use two different colors for this. Let's take the example 38 and I'm going to multiply that number, multiply that number by 7. So I have 38 times 7. Now I wanted to have these be two different colors because um, we're really going to break this number apart. We're going to take a look at exactly what makes a number a number first. Now, First we have 38. Now we know 38 is 30 plus 8. And then when we have 7, well 7 is the only number in that value, so we have the number 7. Now you're going to notice that we have two different colors here, and we have three total numbers. Now what's going to happen is I'm going to multiply 30 times 7, and I'm going to multiply 8 times 7, and then I'm going to add those two numbers together. So 30 times 7 is going to give us 210. And 8 times 7 is 56. I'm going to write that over in parentheses just so we know. 30 times 7. And 56 was 8 times 7. After we've gotten both of these done, all you do is add those up. And your answer to 38 times 7 is 266. Now I'll show you one more time. I'll give you another opportunity to view this. Let's take the number 55 and let's multiply that number by 9. So we have 55 times 9. Again, we're going to break that first number. That first number is 55 into two different numbers. It's 50 times 5. We're going to multiply this by 9. So we have 50 plus 5 and then 9. Now what we're going to do here again, remember, is we're going to multiply these two numbers. We're going to multiply those two numbers, add them up, and we will have our product. 50 times 9, we have 1, 0, and then 45, so 450. And then we have 5 times 9, equals 45. After that we're going to add this up. We have 5, 4 plus 5 is 9, and then 4 for 495. And that's, that's exactly how you multiply a double digit number by a single digit number.